Happy third block nights. Welcome to Nightline News. Broadcasting live from McCabe Park World News Headquarters, I'm Jordan. And I'm Thomas. Today is Tuesday, April 2nd, and it is a day one. Now let's head over to our AP's resident meteorologist, Abe, with today's weather. Thank you, Jordan and Thomas. Today, there will be a high of 52 degrees with a low of 39, and it is expected to be mostly cloudy. And now, Jordan and Thomas, what are some things happening here at AP that students should know about? Thanks for asking, Abe. Million Word Challenge. Reading logs for those who participated in the Million Word Challenge were due to Mrs. Clues on the library yesterday. The $25 gift card winner will be announced today. The junior class trip to Hershey Park is Tuesday, May 28th. It is $65. There is one bus, so the trip will be available to the first 50 students who are eligible and pay. Permission slips are in room 245 or the library. See Ms. Salarico or Ms. Clouza with questions. Tutoring. National Honor Society members will be available for tutoring and homework help every Tuesday after school until 3 in Ms. Ryder's room, room 220. Art scholarships. Students. The art department has new scholarships available for a variety of local art institutions. If you're interested, see Mr. Kowski. Junior prom. Junior prom tickets will be on sale until April 19th in the library and room 245. Tickets are $65 per person, cash only. The junior prom will be held on April 26th at 7 p.m. Students, $450 citations will still be given if you observe sitting on or leaning against cars and vehicles, including motorcycles, in the staff parking lots. Additionally, for your own safety, do not hang out in the staff parking lots. This means no standing around, walking, running, or playing their parked cars. Please stay on the sidewalks. And remember, when you're on lunch, show respect for everything the cafeteria staff does to make your lunch experience a good one by keeping your area clean. And now here is Abe with sports. Thank you, Thomas. The boys' tennis team dropped a hard-fought 5-0 decision to visiting Oxford team yesterday. Playing well for the improving nights were Mel Schofield and Abdul Thali in singles, and the double teams of Calvin Keyes and Owen Nelson, Dylan Sakazic and Marcel Cooper, and Nigel Dundas and John Stevens. The team is reminded to be on the courts right at the school today for practice. Today, girls varsity and JV lacrosse takes on Chichester at Knight Park. Varsity at 345 and JV at 445. Boys varsity and JV baseball plays Pennwood away. Game starts at 345. And girls varsity and JV softball plays Chichester away. Game starts at 345. And now, Nightline News brings your daily horoscopes with Thomas and Jordan. Thank you, Abe, for your daily horoscope. If you are Aries, you need to make changes that will raise your self-esteem. Don't put limitations on yourself. Taurus, your personality will earn the admiration of others. Be careful with money today. Gemini, you can make new friends by exploring new hobbies. Cancer, your ability to come up with good solutions for problems will be noticed if you commit to getting the work done today. Leo, your high energy should be spent helping others. Listen carefully to the advice of others today. Virgo, your accomplishments could exceed the expectations of everyone you know if you stay focused. Libra, look for ways you can learn to relax and ease stress. Consider a creative hobby. Scorpio, try to visit friends or relatives you don't get to see often. Sagittarius, you can establish positive new relationships today by listening respectfully to what others have to say. Capricorn, Despite some uncertainties in your life right now, concentrating on the task at hand will get you through. Aquarius, don't let people get under your skin. Explore a variety of relaxation techniques. Pisces, stay focused on responsibilities if you want to turn your life around. Self-improvement could bring amazing results. Well, that is all for today's horoscopes. Let's go to, over to Victoria with this day in history. Thank you, Thomas. Today is World Autism Awareness Day. World Autism Awareness Day was established on December 18, 2007 by the United Nations to raise awareness of autism in the global community. Autism affects approximately one out of every 150 children around the world. It is a neurodevelopment disorder that affects their ability to socialize normally by impacting their abilities to utilize verbal and nonverbal communication. Since 2012, there has been a 30% increase in the amount of children affected with autism, a world autism Autism Awareness Day helps to bring awareness to this growth, growing health concern. From everyone here on Nightline News, I'm Victoria. I'm Abe. I'm Jordan. And I'm Thomas. Have a great day, Knights. Keep the electronics out of sight and the student IDs visible. 
And remember, you can't cross the sea merely by standing and staring at the water. Thanks, Knights, for tuning in this morning.